afternoon, everyone. This is Jared Rand, and welcome to the Global Guided Meditation Call for 3 p.m. Eastern, November 15th, 2018. When we look at the uh, planet, we look at Gaia, and we see changes happening. We see a lot of changes happening. Obviously, when we do float up above the planet, we are looking at a lot of things. We can zoom in anytime we want to look at different areas to see what is transpiring. And when we see things that are disturbing, that don't make any sense, that we know that destruction doesn't make any sense. We know that this, it doesn't accomplish, it, it, well, it, it, it accomplishes destruction, but it isn't in the energy of high vibrational frequency. The destruction, negativity, uh, the, the stuff that it creates, the, the hatred, the, 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 uh, the ignorance of, instead of creating, you're destroying it. So, obviously, it does not even fit in with where we are going. And as we're on that journey, we're on that path. So we identify, and I know a lot of people get very irritated because of what's, what the things that they see, that, and they're, they're, they're aware that they have the knowledge, that they really looked at it and see what's actually happening uh, and what's being done. Uh, to humanity. So, as we look at this, we see any uh, abnormalities, anything that we see that is not good vibrational frequency, it doesn't take us long to pick it up. You could just be sitting uh, somewhere and feeling it on the planet. And we have things that are so lopsided. You know, we have people starving. We have we have over a billion humans that are on almost the verge of starvation. A billion, over a billion humans, almost on the verge of starvation. We have, and we address these. We address them as not foreboding, but we are identifying these negatives uh, for humanity because it creates no value for humanity at all. It is just total destruction. So we are here to assist in the elimination of that heinous energy. And the way to do it is to embrace all of it with deep eternal love, intense deep eternal love, massive deep eternal love, where it literally burns through the negative field and eliminates any resistance uh, uh, called destruction. And anything we come across, anything that we come across that is distasteful usually means that the frequency, the vibration of that distastefulness is a low frequency. And see, as all of you are continually elevating yourselves, going up and up and up in frequency, the more distasteful it becomes. So anger begets anger. All of these things are interconnected. So we don't go there. There's no reason for it. We, we instead go from our heart mind and we waterfall deep eternal love to all the situations on the planet. Now, we want to pinpoint all the chemtrails across the planet. And we also want to pinpoint all the fires currently blazing on the planet. 
Those are two areas we want to identify. And the third one is all of those beings who are participating in creating this destruction. Those are three elements. Okay? We have the fires on the planet currently that are active. We have the chemtrails in our upper atmosphere being sprayed on us and all life. And we have those beings who are participating in that frequency, that energy. Those are the three areas currently. There's many more, but we, you know, addressing, we want to pinpoint a few, a certain amount at a time, and then wrap it all up at the end uh, with many more. But this today, those are the three areas. And it's to nullify and neutralize and saturate all of this with prime source creator God's eternal love. All of it. So we face it. We see it. We witness our deep eternal love coming in and literally dispersing it. Turning darkness into light. So if you will, go to your place where you are not going to be interrupted, which I'm sure most of you are. While I'm talking, you want to relax. And as you're relaxing, let everything, you're, remember you're in the moment. You're in the now, right now in the moment. You embrace that. You're not in the past. You're not in the future. You are in control of the noise, the thoughts. You are in control. Your heart mind is the master of all. Not your mind. Your heart mind is the master. You step outside of the mind and the ego. So you no longer are being manipulated and controlled by the mind's thoughts actions in the ego's incessant hunger for more. You let it go. You are light, you are buoyant, you are floating. And you are in total peace in the now. And then you begin to breathe. And as you breathe, you breathe in through the nose and you breathe out through the mouth. You breathe in and you hold it 1001, 1002, 1003. And then you exhale through the mouth. As you breathe in, you're breathing in divine positive energy, which encompasses tremendously deep and powerful eternal love, saturating everything super boosting you turning you all into super gods and super goddesses this eliminates all resistance to love all feelings of unworthy of love, all attitudes to oneself, self-discrimination, self-abuse, self-denial, all of these things are eliminated through this intense, deep eternal love flowing in you, through you, and around you, directly from prime source, creator God. As you breathe out, you're breathing out all but the breath. Useless energy, patter, negativities, all kinds, all the things that you feel that you're not.
not worthy of. Eliminate them. Let them go. Breathe. Take in the glorious, deep, eternal love. Exhale all of these mind-invented illusions. Eliminate them. Let them go. Remember, you're the master. What we want to do is we want to go in through the heart-mind, right center of the chest, right up by the clavicle. As we go in, we go in deep and we move up. We vibrate up. Remember, we are being saturated with deep eternal love. We find ourselves encased in a perfect sphere of prime source creator God's golden white pink light, prime deep eternal love. The Archangel Raphael's emerald green flaming healing light saturating us, flowing around and everywhere. The purple transmuting flame transmuting all negatives, all lower vibrations into new, neutral light substances, sending it back to the great central sun for repurposing. The And you have the violet ray of cleansing and purification and strengthening. And you have the white fire of total purification and protection. You, you, you feel this all around you. The only thing that can penetrate it is deep eternal love. You are completely wrapped in protection. We turn, we turn and we see our higher selves and absolutely immediately gravitate, embrace our higher selves. Full body hug, boom. We are one. We are in contentment. We are in tranquility. When we're with our higher self, we become one in total peace, total love, total prosperity. We're all in communication with our higher self now, and we also communicate with any higher self that we can get permission to talk with to build the unification of all beings, inhabitants of this planet. Arm in arm, hand in hand, we join, we form our circle, and we float up effortlessly, softly, above the planet. And as we do this, we call upon all light beings from all dimensions, from all existences, from all universes, from all galaxies, who are of deep eternal love and from deep eternal love to join us in this meditation and we thank them. We call upon all of the archangels, the cherished Cherubim, cherubim, the seraphim, and the archetypes. All of deep eternal love from deep eternal love to join us in this meditation. And we ask and invite all angels from all areas of deep eternal love from deep eternal love to join us in this meditation. And we thank them. We call upon all of the galactics of different civilizations who are aiding and assisting the transition of this civilization and the habitants of this planet at this time, who are all of benevolent energies of the highest frequencies and who are of deep eternal love and from deep eternal love to join us in this meditation and we thank them. We call upon all of the inhabitants of inner earth and hollow earth of deep eternal love and from deep eternal love to join us in this meditation and we thank them. We call upon all of our loved ones who have passed in this life and all of our loved ones from all lives who have passed who are of deep eternal love and from deep eternal 
love to join us in this meditation, and we thank them. We call upon all of the Ascended Masters of Deep Eternal Love and from Deep Eternal Love to join us in this meditation, and we thank them. We call upon the fairies, the sprites, the elves, the gnomes, the unicorns, the pegasus, all of deep eternal love and from deep eternal love to join us in this meditation, and we thank them. We see our meditative sphere floating. It is housing all of our meditations, which we're heading towards 300. And it is infused with the golden white pink light, Prime Source Peter God's Deep Eternal Love, Archangel Raphael's emerald green flaming healing light, the purple transmuting flame, the violet ray, and the white fire. All in, in the housing, all of our meditations in perpetual motion. It hums with the deepest of eternal love. We feel the rain coming over our heads, our foreheads down, saturating our physical bodies from head to toe, warmly. A warm heat flowing, nurturing and caring for us. Infusing us with a super beam of prime source creator God's deep eternal love, supercharging us. We look down on the planet, we see the skies, the atmosphere, we see that it's in trouble. We look at it and we see these foreign elements floating uh, in the atmosphere and falling down onto the life on the planet. And we infuse it with the eternal love. We also transmute it, neutralize it with the purple transmuting flame. We construct a prism sheathing in the upper atmosphere of the planet and act infused with crystalline energy of the purple transmuting flame and the uh, Archangel Raphael's emerald green healing flaming light and of course the pink fire light of deep eternal love golden light pink light prime source creator gods deep eternal love all imbued in this sheathing all around the planet it is opaque it is crystalline it is surging with energy with the highest vibrational frequencies and it is transmuting and eliminating the chemicals in these tra chemtrails as they are referred to all over the planet this is a permanent construct in the etherics that we have built and created this day and it will nullify any of the attempts to lower the frequency of the planet and its atmosphere and all life. All of the in ingredients of these will be transmuted into neutralized substance by the purple transmuting flame. We watch as this takes place. We can zoom in as close as we want, or we can zoom out and just watch from afar with the deepest eternal love in all of our heart minds pulsating as we view it in joy and bliss. Also, we form on the ground and above and below the fires on the planet. This is a crystalline blue flaming light. Now the flame part of it is moisture. So it's a reverse
spiritual uh, vibrational frequencies. It is a magical fire of moisture. And it is laid below the soil and it is, acts as a magnet to attract all moisture needed and necessary in vibrational frequency to saturate the ground and eliminate any, any opportunity for combustion and fire to be active. Above it, we have a silvery blue crystalline energy that is absorbing the moisture in the atmosphere to create a moisture barrier across all of these fires. So understand, as we watch, as we are creators, we have created these constructs. And they are funneling our highest of high energies through our heart minds to extinguish this abuse of the planet and life by increasing the vibrational frequencies ever so high. And all of those on top of that, we direct our energies towards all those beings who are participating in these activities of low vibrational frequency and we transmute them and we literally envelop them in an ocean of deep eternal love, emerald green flaming healing light and the purple transmuting flame and the violet ray. So we are neutralizing their angers and their destructive energies. And we are, remember, they are in an ocean of deep eternal love. They're being totally in, enveloped in this ocean of deep eternal love. They're, they have nothing but higher vibrational frequencies that will occur. This is something they cannot fight. This is something that will overtake them. And we're watching all of this take place. We are viewing it with great joy and great deep eternal love. This is all our action is peace, joy, love, and bliss and healing being directed to these three elements of low vibrational frequency. So we watch it take place. And we participate in those frequencies elimination. I'll join you in meditation and I'll be back to close this out.
watch in amazement as this energy flourishes and stays constant and consistent. So it almost reads the lower frequencies and then it literally comes in and embraces them and pulls them and neutralizes them and increases the field of vibrational frequency all where they were. So watch this, as it's been engaged, it will continue to generate. It will continue to eliminate the fires. It will start to nullify and transmute all of the negative vibrational frequencies of the chemicals in our air. And most importantly, it will saturate all those involved with this destruction of life. So we will, and are experiencing great change, great positive, uplifting change. Do not let your minds and egos dictate to you any longer. It is much, much counterproductive for us to spend any more precious energies on those illusions because we are literally moving up and elevating ourselves upward. So I, I, as I mentioned a few times, I will be on this radio show, this uh, blog talk of uh, ground Ground, ground Command Control uh, Blog Talk Radio at 9 p.m. Eastern. And um, get, you only want to get as many people as you can there so that they can learn more about the meditation and, you know, what our purpose is and why we've all come together at this time and what its effect are continually having on the planet. It cannot not affect. Everybody should, I think you all realize that. It cannot not affect. It is affecting greatly in many, many areas. And some of you have written in and have witnessed some of those areas and shared them. So from our prime source creator, creation of all creation, Deep love, deep eternal love is continually, not intermittently, but continually being sent to each and every one of us without fail, without ceasing. Our vibrational frequencies, you can feel them in your heart mind, are continually raising, rising, elevating. Take it with you. Take this engagement that we have just put into play with you. Revisit it throughout the day, the evening and the night, and into tomorrow morning. The more deep love you give it, the more intensity of dispersing these destructive energies will accelerate. 